Hi, I'm Barbara Rickard. Welcome to my one-woman show at the River Gallery in North Tonawanda. I want to start by telling you about my painting style, which you is represented by my brother here. Every time I'm stuck for an idea, I'd say to my brother, hey Bill, hey Rick, give me a face, because I need material. And because he's in the theater, he was always a very good subject. And if asked to describe my style, I always wanted to be like dark and brooding. I remember I was in a car accident when I was a teenager and I thought, oh, I want to represent the struggle that I'm having. But it just didn't work because I don't feel that way. I looked at the painting and said, who are you trying to kid? I like my paintings to be lively. I like them to be fun, engaging. The paintings I do for myself are just expressive. I love to paint, I love to blend colors, I love to see what I end up with. But the paintings I do for Buffalonians, I try to incorporate features of Buffalo that they care about. Oftentimes it's the architecture, oftentimes the food. But we have so much to celebrate in Buffalo and I, I try to make my Buffalo not one from uh, Wyoming, I want it to be specific to us that we care about. When I worked on Juicy Couture over here, our celebratory food, the chicken wing, how can I incorporate that into this animated, sweet looking sweetheart of a buffalo? And there it is, splashing on her nose. I ran into one guy after my first art show who said uh, something to the, to the manner of, boy, I'm not painting another buffalo because everybody in Buffalo wants some buffalo to represent their product. To me, I said move to Cleveland because Buffalo, it's so fun to make characters out of the buffaloes, the slightest little, how do you capture that smirk to make life look like he's up to something? Is it mischievous? Is it, you know, a prankster? So I have a good time doing animated buffaloes and making them rich with color. Okay. <laughs>